Hello, I'm Michelle Ruiz. I have been spending a lot of time talking with successful bloggers and consulting with them about what makes for good blog content. And the reason I've been doing that is because I am getting ready to launch another company. And I decided this time around, I'm going to tell my story. So in, the, in deciding how I'm going to chronicle the story, I decided to blog about it and vlog about it. Hence, Michelle Ruiz, my life as a Latina entrepreneur, where not only will I be talking about launching a new business and growing it and etc but also uh, what it's like to be a Latina in the business world and the uh, balancing act that I often go through uh, balancing both business and family and my children and things like that so I want to find out what makes good blog content in particular how these bloggers who um, have large followings and in addition to that have been able to monetize their blogs, how they've been able to do it. And so um, I think the key ingredient, the key piece of advice I've been getting from these successful bloggers is that you really need to be passionate about the topic that you're blogging about. And the reason for that is because one, you won't run out of topics to talk about, blog about. And two, your enthusiasm will come through. So when you are sitting and writing about, let's say your passion, I have this friend who's passionate about salsas. So if, if that were my passion, I were blogging about it, uh, the way I talk about it, the way I write about it, the way I communicate about it um, would demonstrate my enthusiasm for it. And that's part of what makes for good content because people can see that, can relate to that and then we'll come back and want more. The other thing is is that by uh, being able to talk about it a lot, and, and usually that's what happens when you're passionate about something, then you won't run out of topics and you'll be able to continue to create more and more content. And in terms of monetizing your content, if you create these niche areas, and so let's say it's salsas or let's say it's fly fishing, or in my case it's entrepreneurship, uh, and you build a large enough following and part of building a large enough following is uh, being consistent about what you're talking about once you build a large enough following then you will be able to monetize uh, your content which I'll talk about more specifically in another video so um, the key thing is if you're considering about uh, considering blogging uh, you should ask yourself what are you passionate about and if you focus on what you're passionate about and you focus on making sure that as you create your content, as you write and as you vlog, that you create it in such a way as if, imagine as if you were sitting and just talking with someone, then that style, that very comfortable conversational style will come through. This is actually a tip that uh, I can relate to back from my broadcasting days in that, um, you know, when you're sitting in front of a camera, you should really think about you know that you're just really having a conversation with one person on the other side of the camera and not about how you think you should come across or in relating it to blogging not writing in a style that's very formal or technical unless of course that's what your blog is about uh, just try and, and make sure that your style is conversational and that it's personable uh, just you know imagine just write as if you were sitting down with your best friend and telling her or him about the topic that you're writing about and then just let the words flow uh, or the uh, or your your vlogs just just go ahead and consider doing them in that style I hope that helps you and I hope that you have a wonderful day